So you want to make more money on Amazon merch. There are a few things you need to consider. I would highly recommend choosing designs and niches that are in demand, they're selling, but they don't have oversaturation yet. They haven't reached a point where it would be very difficult to rank for the first page, right? So today I'm gonna be showing you some designs that are trending right now. The best seller rank is going down, which means the sales volume is going up. And I'm gonna be not only showing you these designs, but showing you how to find them yourself so that as new trends emerge, you can go and find them yourself. So I'm gonna be using a tool called Podly and I'm gonna be using their trending search tool specifically. And then I'm going to be sorting by best seller rank lowest to highest. Now, some of these designs you're going to want to avoid Barbie, for example, anything that is TV show related, movie related, stay away from it. Um, you don't want to get banned off Amazon. You want to keep your account. We want to have a long term history with this program and make money over years, not over months. So if you'll see here, the general trend, I would say about 60 to 70% of the best sellers right now are Thanksgiving and fall related. So I'm seeing lots of turkey. I'm seeing lots of pumpkin pie. I'm seeing a crossover between Thanksgiving and drinking that seems to be doing well. I'm seeing our iconic Bigfoot and Thanksgiving crossover. So um, if you don't know this already, I sell a lot of Bigfoot style designs that are crossed with other niches. It's just something that's not trademarked that people like that people are fascinated by and you can always cross it with different niches it could be a sasquatch carrying a bag of presents and a santa hat and then you have a new design so you can use ai to create designs like this and i highly encourage you to go check out some of the other videos we have some free ai tools at our disposal at this point that can help us create designs just like this and even designs with text so lots of thanksgiving stuff going on but if you're not into the holiday style trends you can still follow um, you can still look through these trends and find some really nice gold nuggets that you're not going to be able to find just manually going through Amazon right so let's keep looking through here see what we can find this one's kind of interesting obviously very easy to design I don't know if maybe there's some sort of meme or something that's causing this to sell well at the moment this pickle shirt here is kind of funny it's just a bunch of different pickles on a shirt um, there's no real explanation behind that either vintage canned pickles lover so that's I, I guess this is probably for people who like to can pickles but it just goes to show you I never personally would have thought about this and I probably never would have found it without using some sort of trend research tool so there is a seven day free trial that you can try for podly the link is below if nothing else just give it a shot for seven days and get some trend ideas get used to some of the designs that are selling well and start making money and then if you don't like it then you can always cancel it but let's keep going looking at some of these designs here this is a little bit more evergreen we have sasquatch putting up the rock on symbol um, we have so the title is rock on bigfoot sasquatch uh rock and roll so those would be kind of the keywords that you would use um again back to thanksgiving but back to cross niches the t-rex and thanksgiving cross niche so you can take t-rex and cross it with anything um let's keep going here i'm seeing lots of these designs where a turkey is portrayed as a different type of animal because obviously it's trying to hide um, from being a turkey so it doesn't get eaten for thanksgiving so i'm seeing lots of these this is a more evergreen design here where we have a cat that has of rock paper scissors shown um if i were to try and recreate this design yes i might try the cat paw again but honestly i would probably try different animals i would try a dog paw i would try bunnies because fun fact rabbits are the third most popular household pet so um rabbits are definitely a huge niche that most people do not look at so i would try this with other types of paws you may need to enlist a designer to help you with this one um, to get that specific shape but AI is getting pretty good, so you may give it a shot with that as well. Um, seeing lots of hunting style designs at the moment because deer season is back in season in the United States. So guys, this is exactly how I find designs that are selling well. This this deer design right here, an estimated 45,000 monthly revenue in sales, which doesn't mean a ton, but 2,200 sales on average monthly for that shirt. So they have to be making some pretty healthy commissions. I'm seeing lots of shirts 
that say this is my it's too hot for ugly Christmas sweaters shirt. So I think that's a good niche to be in as well. Get in early because not everyone wants to wear an ugly Christmas sweater to a Christmas party. They may just get lazy and they may just buy a shirt. And so I'm seeing lots of that work as well. So honestly, I feel like Podly is one of the best product research tools out there at the moment for Amazon merch specifically. Obviously, I use other tools um, for other applications and other ways of selling. But for Amazon merch, Podly is absolutely on top of the trends, which is where you need to be. Not only what's selling well, but what hasn't been completely tapped into and oversaturated and oversold yet. So guys, I don't want to reveal too much, but I do have group coaching coming out soon. So be sure to subscribe so you get more informa information if you want to join group coaching. If you want to book a one-on-one -on -one call, I have a link below. I'd love to help you with your Amazon merch business, your print-on-demand business in general, Facebook ads, anything you need help with in your e-commerce business. And guys, be sure to join, join the free Facebook group and leave a comment below with any questions you have. Until next time, create something awesome. Have an amazing day. I'll see you in the next video.